Fido. Uh, I've got an uh, appointment with Dr Holden. Good to see you guys. How can I help? I really would like to do some kind of fertility test. I am 35. I don't know how long I've got. I don't know how many eggs I have. Is that an option? Can Absolutely. I do that? Absolutely. Look, we certainly know that the longer we push this into the late 30s, mm. it does get trickier to conceive naturally. And the reason we should be doing tests is obviously it gives us an idea as to is there anything holding you back from your ability to conceive? Yeah. Are you going to be medically well during pregnancy? So things like, you know, iron deficiency and, and also obviously we want to make sure that if you are going to get pregnant, well, you know, we give you every opportunity in having the, the best, healthiest child that you can have. I must say I'm, there's definitely a part of me that's a bit uh, curious. For a man, when he gets a fertility test, is he going to go into a room well, and, look at, and look at porn? I think there's obvious well, things that needs to happen. <laughs> like a male fertility test? Like, Absolutely. I can go in with you, it's all right. OK. Well, are you at, Makes my hands a bit sweaty. Yeah, that's a, like a, that's like a dude thing, you know? We Like, it's, that's... I don't know, it's like girls and their eggs. It's like guys and their... No, it is, it's actually... Guys and their swimmers. That's, that's a bit... Uh, like, my hands are a bit sweaty. Certainly we'll get some tests done. I think that's a great idea. It'll give us a bit of a lay of the land, see where we're at, get all the answers that you need and help with your ultimate decision. Cool. Cool. OK. No problems. Thank you. Thank you.